this video is about the RCI off-road uh, aluminum uh, fuel tank skid plate. Uh, the focus of this video is about uh, the exposed front section uh, of the skid plate as you can see here uh, from the RCI off-road website. That entire front section is exposed to the elements so any uh, potential objects uh, that uh, can uh, come from under the tire or uh, during your drive off-road or on the freeway uh, potentially could uh, hit the uh, front of the gas tank as it's exposed. This one is the website of uh, Victory 4x4. They too uh, don't have that uh, section uh, covered either and I'm comparing uh, their aluminum skid plate uh, to the RCI off-road uh, as well. Um, so uh, in this video I will show you uh, after I installed it uh, I compared it to the OEM uh, skid plate that came with the uh, 2020 Forerunner TRD off-road and I noticed uh, how the manufacturer spent a lot more uh, metal to protect the front of the gas tank versus the uh, aftermarket uh, skid plate. Um, uh, so uh, this one is a CBI website. Uh, they too don't uh, uh, cover the front of the gas tank as well just like the other uh, two manufacturers. So um, I'll show you how uh, uh, this looks on my foreigner and then uh, I how I remedied uh, the situation there uh, so thanks for watching before I show you the uh, RSI uh, off-road uh, skid plate with the remedy uh, that I put together uh, I wanted to show you the uh, OEM skid plate that came with the uh, foreigner TRD off-road uh, the one that I have is 2020 year model as you can see here um, the level of protection they provided towards the front of the skid plate to protect the gas tank from any debris or objects that potentially can uh, hit the gas tank from uh, going off-road uh, or uh, uh, even driving on uh, city streets or uh, freeways. Um, so you can see here there are uh, different uh, kind of uh, precise cuts around the skid plate uh, to help uh, that uh, um, add protection uh, that uh, white plastic you see there uh, is put together to help route a cable around uh, the gas tank and keep it in place as you can see here uh, measuring the um, this vertical protection um, it is uh, around uh, eight and a half, nine inches uh, on the tall side, and it's around five inches on the lower side. Uh, it's all around uh, the front of the uh, gas tank uh, to provide uh, uh, protection, uh, not only uh, uh, to protect the gas tank from the bottom, uh, but also uh, to protect the gas tank all, uh, all around. Uh, you see here, um, this car had, uh, my car had about uh, a few hundred miles on it. Uh, I took it off-road already and you could see uh, the uh, skid plate was uh, uh, scratched or uh, you know uh, I, I slid uh, on top of a rock so you can see here um, the damage uh, that happened. It's almost towards the uh, wall of the skid plate uh, not underneath it so um, this also had me uh, even um, be more concerned that uh, uh, this uh, aftermarket uh, skid plate only provided protection for uh, underneath the gas tank but not uh, all uh, around uh, the gas tank. What you see here is uh, the RCI off-road uh, uh, aluminum skid plate for the Forerunner gas tank uh, installed and uh, based on what I shared with you from the uh, OEM footages uh, you can see here the level of exposure uh, of the gas tank uh, from the uh, front and uh, it's about uh, eight and a half inches tall uh, from this section and uh, all around towards that uh, kind of um, you know uh, it curves out uh, uh, towards the uh, back of the truck you see here this section is mostly uh, concerning me even more than the front because uh, as soon as the gas tank starts curving out um, it, it, get, it becomes exposed 
So in event of uh, sliding over an uneven or uh, uh, sharp uh, rock, uh, you could see how that uh, could become an issue potentially uh, and, and uh, uh, potentially damage the gas tank uh, as, as you slide over something like that. Um, so uh, m my hope is, is that uh, by sharing this video, hopefully those uh, aftermarket uh, uh, metalwork uh, companies can uh, make this uh, more similar to the OEM uh, skid plate to basically uh, make, make the gas tank fully protected. And that's the idea. As, as we are investing money to purchase these uh, aftermarket skid plates, uh, our hope is, is that they provide uh, better protection than the OEM skid plate uh, for our cars. Uh, yet, in this case, uh, these uh, skid plate for the gas tank, they leave a big portion of it uh, exposed to elements and uh, potentially uh, uh, creating uh, a risk. Uh, I bought a sheet of uh, aluminum from uh, our local home improvement store and uh, cut two pieces. One of them uh, is uh, the long straight piece that covers uh, the interior side of the gas tank. And uh, I cut another uh, uh, sheet that is a little bit taller uh, to cover the front of the uh, gas tank. As you can see here, the gap between uh, the RCI off-road uh, skid plate and the sheet that I put together, that gap actually is the short uh, surface coverage that uh, the OEM one covers, but uh, the aftermarket one does not. I don't think this is a perfect solution. Uh, there's a lot of room for improvement here, but uh, at least I feel more comfortable driving, uh, knowing that uh, if debris uh, comes through, at least this thin sheet of aluminum will protect the gas tank from that. 